after 10 a.m. on Sunday, June 12th. And yes, as you can tell by the gray sweater, I haven't even showered or changed yet. I barely finished my coffee. And you know what? I'm okay with it. Sometimes you just gotta do what feels right. All right. I do think I should take a shower and get dressed now though. So, and get on with our day and maybe do something besides sit on the couch and watch movies. You know. All right, I'll Hello, be back. Friend. Yep. I'm going to leave you alone. Fun fact. I'm allergic to them. All of them. Anything with that many. All arachnids. But yeah, we do live next to the woods, so at least he's a little guy. It is Monday morning. Of course it is. I just got the vlog edited and it's saving and rendering right now. It's Monday, June 13th, 1048 AM. So it is fiber and supplement time, <laughs> bone broth time. I do it like mid morning. And um, yeah, anyway, so we're gonna go do that while the computer is rendering. The only two things I have on my to-do list today that are must do's are editing the vlog and doing the weekly written posts for social media. Um, I do have some watercolor sketches I wanna do. One of the squirrel when he's sitting outside our food bowl out the window, my picture's not the best, but I might give him a shot anyway, so we'll see. Few chores done, got some sketches done while watching some YouTube on the tablet. I'm going to do a little bit of painting. The computer is turning itself off. I'm going to do a little bit more work over here and then we're going to call it a day. I'll be back. about you guys but I'm loving where that's going we're gonna let it dry and then see if and where we're gonna go with it next hey guys we are out for our evening walk this is one of the prettier spots 
Not that they aren't all pretty because we live in a very nice neighborhood with lots of open green space, but yeah. It's a nice spot. Anyway, it's not too hot, not too cold. It's not sunny, it's overcast. Looks like it's gonna dump rain again any minute because <coughs> it's like 61 degrees out. As I said earlier, it evidently is the wettest, coldest spring we've had in 81 years yep. in Oregon. <laughs> yeah, so any nice. so anyway, we're gonna get some steps in before we eat dinner. Get some exercise. But I'm pretty happy with how my Monday went. I got all my work done plus some. And I love the way that painting turned out. Once it's dry, I'm gonna have to take a second look at it, but it might be finished already. Let's see if there's any ducks. <gasps> there is a whole bunch of ducks. Of course, they're all swimming away from me. Way over there. Cause you know, nature hates me. I swear it does. And I didn't bring them any food, so they're not interested. Hey everybody, it is Tuesday, June 14th, 11.15 a.m. The sun is trying to come out. I see a little bit of blue sky and the, dry, the ground appears to be dry. However, <laughs> while my YouTube channel comments were working this morning, I did wake up a little bit late, but they were working this morning and I was able to check on them downstairs while drinking my coffee. I came down upstairs to check on some more stuff. Suddenly there's no YouTube channel comments and although I'm signed into the account and I can check everything else, I can't check comments, they're just, they're gone. And um, I, of course, am on Google support and they basically have no idea. They're telling me you have to sign into the account for this channel. I'm like, I am signed into the account on this channel. I'm looking at the dashboard. I'm signed into the email. I don't know what you're talking about. It's just a giant mess. I don't know what's going on. So that's a fun way to start the day. I'll be back. With Google and YouTube is never the way I want to start my day. Just saying. <laughs> Holy cow. All right, I'll be back. After that not so fun, like hour with YouTube, only to have them say, we don't know what's wrong, basically. I feel like the old me wants to deal with the stress of it by going shopping, but I'm not going to do that. Um, don't really need anything, number one. Um, I'm gonna sit and have my bone broth. I'm going to read and um, look through my camera roll here on the phone um, for some more pictures to draw in my sketchbook. And I have a couple of art books I need to read, so I'm gonna do that today. Um, one is a magazine, one is a book, which I put away in a safe place, so I've gotta find it. Um, tomorrow is going to be checking the P.O. Box day. I'll probably stop by Goodwill, maybe Dollar Tree. And I have a few like odds and ends I need to pick up. Thursday, Bob is off and Friday. So I don't need to do too much because we can go run errands Thursday after work. Uh, I mean, after work, after counseling. Um, I have counseling in the morning, um, but I'll go do a few things tomorrow. But yeah, I'm gonna just take a deep breath. <sighs> yes. All right, drink my bone broth, do my things for the things, because of the things. I'll be back. Somebody remind me going forward when we go walking to bring my sunglasses. Oh, it's not as cloudy as I thought it was. Yeah, anyway, we're headed back. And then I guess this discussion will be, what are we having for dinner? I mean, most of the time I eat salad, so it's what is he having for dinner? All right, I'll be back.
everybody. It is Wednesday, January something. Let's see. 15th, I think? Hold on. Uh, January. It is the 15th, but it's June. Holy cow. It's 1024 a.m. It's about an hour later than I intended to leave the house. I... Um, you know, I had a lazy lay-in for no particular reason. I'm not mad about it. I just, you know, it is. I overslept a bit. <laughs> My husband even laughed and commented about it because I'm really not one to normally do that. I just dropped it. Uh, nail file. I think it's stuck under there. You know, stuff don't, falls down the crack of the car seat and then... Sometimes it's lost forever, but I got it. I found a pen down there too. I knew there was a pen in here somewhere. Anyway, I slept in this morning. I was kind of tired, not really mad about it. The husband's teasing me about it though, because it's not normal these days for me. Um, oh, pine cones, lots of pine cones, the little baby tiny ones. Um, squirrel. Anyway, I couldn't get to sleep easily last night. Why? Um, my brain just kind of had trouble turning off last night, which is not unusual for me. It's less normal for me now that I'm medicated and in, in counseling than it used to be. That doesn't mean it doesn't still happen. And so anyway, I got up late this morning because I finally did get to sleep and then I stayed asleep. In the old days, I wouldn't sleep at all. So that's a improvement. Um, anyway, hours or more today, doing something wholly unexpected. Got a call from my friend KP over at Art Foamies. By the way, Art Foamies, I'm a designer for them. Um, although they're not sponsoring this video, but anyway, I am a spot. I am a designer for them. So anyway, they have a great company. I love their stamps, not only to. Uh, using my journals and other artwork. They're great for fat. They, they work with fabric paint, watercolor, ink, acrylic paint, like all kinds of stuff. Anyway, she called me and we are going to discontinue one favorite stamp because producing it's very difficult. The way it's drawn when she first got started, she and I didn't do the best at designing it. So I redrew it a couple of different ways. It is going to be re-released. When we have the announcement for that, I will let you know. And there will probably be some new designs coming. So yeah, anyway, we're working on all of that. I didn't expect to be doing that today, but I spent a good two or three hours working on that sort of thing. And yeah, now I've gotta check the mail. Yay, there's mail. I don't think I've vlogged yet today. We are stuck in traffic. It is Thursday, June 16th, I think. Something like that. 2.06 p.m. We started off the morning with a visit from our friendly neighborhood pest people because it's sugar ant season. <laughs> anyway, we got that taken care of and then I had a counseling appointment. Now we're fighting traffic trying to get to Costco and the and Winco, the grocery store, two grocery stores, two. Yep. Yeah. So anyway, <laughs> You know, it's a little town. None of the lights are synchronized, and so when there's more than two cars on the cars on the road, everything gets backed up. So, all right, yeah, that's it for the minute. I ain't got nothing else to add, not at the moment. I did print out some solid color, sort of color swatch stickers earlier. I'm gonna cut them out later. Um, I like. I like using them right now in my journals and I'm using up kind of what I already have in stock but I'm running out so instead of buying stuff I'll just use stuff I have and make my own so we're doing that and um, I added some more pictures to the refrigerator which is half covered with um, the kids baby pictures and the grand pets and all of that stuff so they're all horrified but I told them their pictures don't come down till they have grand till we get grandbabies. And I'm making the two boys add their baby pictures. So, yeah. Anyway. Plus, 
see if that works. Right? Yeah, we'll see if that works. All right, that's it for the minute. I'll be back. The raccoons are in the front yard somewhere again. I probably won't catch them again. I have no idea where they go, but it's a mama and two little babies. If you're watching this clip, you just saw that clip. So I don't, I don't know. <sighs> anyway, we, once we got our grocery shopping done, oh, I had to go to three places to get everything that we needed. Um, we came home and um, I did a bunch of overnight oats and I made a loaf of bread in that $10 bread machine. It works great by the way. Um, I found this stuff called instant sourdough that you use instead of yeast. Skeptical. I was skeptical, but I got it. And I hate feeding sourdough starter. I've done it twice in my life. I'm just over it. Um, we used the instant sourdough and oh my gosh. Yes, it worked. It smelled, the whole house smells like fresh bread. Um, it rose really well. It doesn't taste exactly like sourdough. I didn't really expect it to be, but it does have that slightly sourdoughy taste. We love it. So I'm gonna go back to the store and see if I can grab some more of it. And uh, yeah, anyway. <sighs> it's been a day, but you know, but the bread is delicious and the overnight oats we will try in the morning. We tried a couple of different recipes and we'll see what happens. But yeah, I don't know what the raccoons are after. I have no idea. So there's that. I'll be back. As you can hear, we're watching TV. So anyway, I'll be back. Good morning. It is Friday. It is 10.05 a.m. June something. 18th? No, 17th, I think. Hold on. 17th. Um, I'm headed over to Safeway, another grocery store, because there's a couple things that we need we didn't know we needed or that we forgot to get. So I'm gonna go do that this morning, first thing. My hair is just, I actually had a young man at one of the grocery stores compliment me on my hair yesterday. That was a little odd. Anyway, uh, kids are all coming for dinner tonight, which will be good. Tomorrow, I think we're driving up to my dad's. Um, he's having a neighborhood-wide garage sale over there, so gotta go looking around at that. Plus, I think we're gonna take him out to lunch or dinner or something and give him his Father's Day present. So I've ordered a couple of things for Bob. Of course, they're both late. He doesn't know I've ordered them anyway, and he's told me not to get him anything, but too bad, so sad. Ah! <laughs> so anyway, um, I need to film the Artsy Trio video. Still haven't done that yet. <laughs> I need to get it done soon because yeah, that's a thing It needs to be done. But in the meantime, I'm going to go see if I can find some more of that instant sourdough stuff because holy cow, the, still, the house still smells like a bakery, as my husband says, and it smells really good. So let's go get that done. I'll be back. It's Friday afternoon. It's just about 2.30ish, and we're going to go for a walk. Bob is off today, and um, it's between, between rainstorms, so we're going to use that to our advantage and get some steps in. All the kids are coming for dinner tonight, but if it's rainy and yucky out, and or we start playing a game or doing a puzzle, nobody's gonna wanna go walking. So we're gonna get our steps in now. Well, nobody except Lily anyway. All right, I'll be back. like just one little duck friend today. Stretching a little bit. Yeah. Having a afternoon snooze. Yeah. We've disturbed him. That's okay. Good morning, everybody. It is, I almost said Friday. It's Saturday, June 18th. Tomorrow is actually Father's Day and we're celebrating with Bob and the kids. But today uh, we are driving up to my dad's house in Washington State, it's a couple hours away. And we're gonna go celebrate with him 
Um, bonus for me, he's also having a neighborhood garage sale. That doesn't mean I'll find anything I need to have, but you never know. So we're gonna go do all that, give him his gifts, take him out for lunch, hang out with him for a bit and see what we can see. So we'll bring you with us and we'll be back. So yet again, I forgot until late to close the vlog. It is Saturday night. It is 11.22 p.m. I know, right? But we spent the day up with my dad. The afternoon had a nice lunch with him and a visit with him. That was really great. Um, we went out to a restaurant he likes up there and had a really, really great time with him. Um, and then we came home and we got a few things done here. One of Bob's Father's Day presents came and so... He unpacked that and put it together. Um, and we just chilled here at home. Tomorrow we're gonna go do some stuff with him uh, that he wants to do for Father's Day and that will be in next week's vlog. Anyway, that's it for today and this week. I hope you've all had a good one. And if you need any mental health help like myself, that you reach out to the appropriate people. If you have links or something you think would be helpful to people and you want me to include them in the video description, please let me know and I can do that. All right. <sighs> stay safe, stay healthy, stay creative. Please like, share, and subscribe. Let, leave questions, comments, or concerns down below. Check out the video description for all the relevant links, the happy mail, the social media, the Etsy shop, all the stuff for the stuff because of the stuff. There's some exciting things coming up soon. Uh, yeah, that I can't talk about, but it's exciting. Anyway, um, so that's it for this week. Have a great uh, weekend, everybody. Happy Father's Day, all of you dads out there. And go out and do something nice for you yourselves because you deserve it. I'll see you later. Bye, guys.